In this video, I will be showing you how to clear your internet history, cache, cookies, and other temporary internet files in Google Chrome. Temporary internet files, as the name suggests, are temporary versions of websites. Every time you view a page and you see an image, like the Google logo here, your computer actually downloads a copy, and the next time you view the same website, the image is actually accessed from your computer instead of having to be re-downloaded from the internet. This makes for faster viewing, but can also clog up your hard drive with a bunch of temporary files. So it's a good practice to clear these every once in a while. To do so, click the wrench and go down to Settings. Scroll down to the bottom, click Show Advanced Settings, and Clear Browsing Data. You can also get to the same place by typing Clear in the search box up above. First of all, you have this little drop-down which tells you when to start deleting. If you select the beginning of time, it will delete everything. As you see, there's also more recent options as well. Clear browsing history. This will remove the list of websites you've visited in the past. Most browsers store history and you can access that list through the wrench and history or control H over here. Download history is pretty much the same thing, just the files you've downloaded through Chrome, right below history. Emptying the cache. This is what I was talking about earlier, the temporary versions of websites. Delete cookies and other site plugin data. Cookies are another way of storing data on your computer. Common usage is to keep you signed in on a website. If you delete these cookies and plugin data, you'll most likely be signed out. Clearing the saved passwords. Usually when you sign into a site, Google Chrome asks you, save this password, and if you click yes next time you sign in, you don't actually have to enter the password. It remembers it for you. Clear saved autofill form data will basically remove anything you've saved through autofill. Autofill is a feature in Chrome where you can go into any form and have it automatically fill out your credit card, address, phone number, things that you enter frequently into forms and don't want to bother typing them. If you remove this, you will have to start over with autofill. Clear data from hosted apps. This is things you've downloaded through the Chrome Web Store. And so if you do delete this, most likely anything you saved on the apps will be removed and you'll have to start over. Deauthorizing content licenses applies to Flash Player, where if you sometimes go watch a movie online and rent it, it will give you a content license to allow you to watch the movie, and deleting those will disable you from being able to see that content, but you could probably just go back to the service that you watched the movie from and see it again. I usually clear the browsing history, download history, empty the cache, delete cookies and other site plugin data, I keep my passwords and delete form data. Just click clear browsing data. This may take a while depending on how much temporary files you have. And that is how to clear temporary internet files in Google Chrome.